How y'all doing this morning? Good old Saturday morning. We gonna do some chicken later this afternoon for lunch. I got some uh, bone-in chicken breast, y'all. We gonna be marinating my favorite chicken marinade. Some of this Chevetta's from Buffalo, y'all. Good stuff, garlic -y vinegar marinade. So what I'm gonna do is pour the Chevetta's in here on the chickens. Uh, we'll let them just marinate a few hours. It's a couple hours, probably. This will be plenty. I mean, this stuff is good. Straw marinade. That's what I love about the Chevetta's, too. You don't have to marinate long, so I'm gonna set this in the refrigerator, seal this up, and let it marinate for a couple hours, and we'll get it on low and slow, y'all. Hey, y'all, Joe here, Southern Coast of Cooking. Anyway, we got that chicken marinating in that wonderful Chevetta's, and man, we're gonna be barbecuing some chicken. That's what we're doing out here today now. Uh, get the grill over here, uh, my Yoder 640. Got it ready to go. We're gonna, as far as pellets today, we use these lumberjack Italian blend here. And what that is, uh, Italian spice blend, it's got a lot of garlic in it, a little bit of oregano, stuff like that. So we definitely just gonna have a good garlic taste with it, complement that Shavetta's. So I've got a little bit, last night, I got a little bit of my, or not full, it's a little bit of rosemary pellets, pellets left in there, the rosemary flavor, the Bordeaux, French. Paris blend, but I'm gonna open up these uh, these garlic Italians, and we'll put some of this Italian blend in here, y'all. Let's go ahead and do that. And that way, uh, and this this will blend nicely. Be great for chicken. So I'm gonna fill my hopper here, these ways with these Italian blend pellets. I always want to make sure you got plenty of pellets in the hopper before you start. Alright, good idea now. For this cook, at least. Okay. Man, it's a little bit of garlic, little spices in those, so let's go ahead and shut this off. Shut that. And then I'm going to turn the yogurt on. See, it's 40, my firmware go up. And I'm going to hit start. Let it start heating up. I'm going to turn it down from 350 to about 250. It's going to start this chicken out smoking. And as soon as we get our grill lit here, we'll know it lights in just a minute. We'll shut this door here and um, we'll be ready to go. I'm going to let it preheat for a little bit though today. Get the chicken on there. Man, this is going to be real good, y'all. All right, y'all just spot a flame there inside the firebox. So, we're gonna, oh, get this out of the way. Shut this down, and we're gonna let it preheat just for a bit, y'all. It's gonna be really good. Hey, y'all, or hey, boys, girls, dogs, and cats, as JB would say, we gonna rub this chicken down with some of this hey boy rub here. So you can get it his uh, JB's blog spot right there. Anyway. Some real good stuff that complements the Chevetta's very well. So what I've done, I had that chicken, remember, marinating in the Chevetta's. What we're going to do is uh, we'll go ahead and put some of this rub on here. I already put some on the bottom of the chicken, but we're going to get the top here. And this is going to give us a wonderful flavor. And this is for cooking, you know, at about 300 degrees and below. You might be able to go up to 350. So we're going to do these chickens low and slow here today uh, with the hay boy and the chevettes. But this is going to be some real good stuff, y'all. I'm looking forward to uh, trying this on chicken last weekend. I guess it was or the weekend before last. We put this on some pork butts, brisket, everything. It did real well. This weekend we'll go ahead and do this chicken up with it. All right, y'all getting ready to put this chicken on. It's going to be real good. Man, I can't wait. Stuff. Open up the yogurt. Let's go ahead and get you zoomed in right here on my grill. Where we're going to go with this, kind of over here on the uh, left hand side, some. So I'm going to take these big old chicken breasts. I mean, that's serious size of these dudes. So I'm going to tear it. Man, it's going to be good, y'all. Hopefully, you can see. Right. 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 Right.
some of these largest chicken breasts so we can kind of know what's going on with them. Right down there, very meat everything. There, like I said, we got this JV rub on them. We've got the marinade and that Shivatas. These ought to be real good, y'all. There we go. It's gonna be something else, I'm telling y'all. <laughs> We're gonna have us a feast after a while with some of that good chicken. Okay, we've been cooking for about a couple of hours now. If y'all want to take a look, we'll take a peek in here and see what's going on. Uh, we're internal temp on the chicken by 145. Of course, we're going to go about 20 more degrees. Let's just see what they look like. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? They're developing a nice, nice skin crisping up and everything like that. It looks real good. So, we're going to go ahead and let them go. Low and slow still, y'all. But I uh, just wanted to do a little check up on them, see what was going on. Got to at least check on them one time. I know you ain't supposed to open it. You're looking in and cook them. We got to check on them at least once, y'all. So we ain't but a few degrees away from uh, our target temperature on a chicken. So what we'll do now, I'm going to sauce them. I'm going to show you what we're going to sauce them with. Let me zoom in here a little bit while we kind of make our, our sauce, so to speak. I have got this uh, limbs meat varnish really love this stuff this is the uh, sweet with a little heat meat varnish here it's a, it's a nice little brown sauce here with a little tomato base so what we'll do with that uh, open it up just got a little bit of it left and then we'll take some of our chavettes the same thing we marinated the chicken in which is a great 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 sauce as well shake it up got a lot of garlic a lot of uh, vinegar and stuff like that in there we're going to pour a little bit of this in there to thin this sauce out some way. Right? And then I'm going to take, uh, I've got one of these, chop all these little chain link basin brushes here. And we're just going to stir this up, y'all. And what we're going to do is we want to base the chicken with this. This is going to be perfect right here. It's going to have us, you know, just the right consistency. It's going to give us the uh, right color and everything else. Let's open these up here. Oh wow, look at that, y'all. Let me get you in here on this chicken. Oh my goodness. Looks gorgeous. Well, we just go ahead and baste it up just a little bit with this sauce that I just kind of mixed here with these two. Oh, look at that. Right there. You see, that's the Right there on top of JV's rub, that hay boy rubs will give us it's a perfect flavor. I mean, look at the, oh my gosh, that skin on the chicken is crisp up just perfect. So we put that with the we got a little bit of the uh, meat varnish just to give it shellac this up with just a perfect touch, y'all. Go ahead and get these real quick. And like I said, keep that skin crispy. And we'll almost be done right here. This is going to be absolutely wonderful. I mean, y'all, I know uh, it's hard for you to hear me a little bit over the fan, this grill and everything like that, but I will be getting in, uh, said so this in another video, a microphone, a we'll clip on mic next week. So hopefully uh, next video you'll be able to hear me just a little bit better. I do apologize, but y'all, you can see this good cooking here. You know, with this, oh, the odor and everything else. Well, I mean, we've got some good stuff going on here today, y'all. And this, I want this chicken, the skin on this chicken is so crisp, I just can't get over it. It's absolutely wonderful, and I, I like how this, uh, man, this little basin brush, man, this thing's cool. Right there, y'all. Oh, vinegar base is sweet. A tiny bit of heat on there. That's what we need right there. We let these fish off. It is absolutely wonderful. Yeah, also gonna be some really good stuff. I'm glad I got a chance to finally use this thing, man. This thing works great. Tell you what, I can't tell you. Uh, think of both the Russes. 
from from my different YouTube channels, all uh, smoked ribs and uh, smoked roll, and both have used this thing. I've had this thing for a long time, and just haven't used it yet. It's really good. And of course, we got the Shabbat on there with the uh, the meat varnish. This is gonna be some fine stuff, y'all. Let's just wait. Man, oh man, it's gonna be good. All right, y'all, so we're sitting here holding about 156. I'm gonna turn the, the uh, smoke up just a little bit here. Increase from 250 to about two, well, shoot, about 300 there on the firebox, on the, on the controller. I know, uh, It'll be a little bit lower than that, but I think that'll be good. That'll raise us on up that extra 10 degrees that we need to go ahead and take this chicken off. And we'll go ahead and eat y'all. Y'all, we've reached about 165. We'll go ahead and take this chicken off. And man, we'll get it served up here. Get it off. Oh, yeah. Beautiful color to it. Wow. That looks great. That rub and everything. Be good, y'all. Let's go on inside with it. See what we got. Man, that looks good. Alright, y'all. Let's give this beautiful chicken a try. Look. Just, I mean, that, the skin is just perfect on here. Looks as juicy as can be. Put into it here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, wow. Give it a try. The JB rub marinated right there, cooked on the yoder. Look at that beautiful color it's got. Mm, mm, mm. That is delicious. Mm. Wow. Well, yeah, you gotta try that, y'all. Seriously. Um. I will post a link to where you can get this rub or whatever in the Chavez and all that, but that is awesome. Chicken right there to 165 on the other smoker with those uh, the Italian pellets, spicy Italian from Lumberjack. Man, that's a good deal. Y'all please like my video, subscribe to my channel.